Okay, here we go. This is gonna be a real doozy of a day. It's gonna be a great show. And it's time to dance. I'll give you a prep in a second. Put your microphones really close to your mouth. Are we live? Awesome. Brian, you are amazing. Okay, can you turn up the volume? Can you hear the volume right here? Yes, it's all the way at the end. Mine's at the end. So I can't hear you, but I'm hearing the music. That's okay. Yeah, that's good, okay, right? turn okay. it up. Okay. I got your volume right here. Laura, down. Okay, hold on a second. Oh, here we go. <laughs> oh my goodness. Hello, my listening friends. It's so nice we can meet each other on the air on my beautiful best day ever. And for those of you who are new to the Lone McDermott Radio Show, the purpose of the show is to provide a safe place where you can go to when you need a friend. It is my commitment to provide alternative ways to heal, and it is my mission to make awareness, responsibility, and truth a part of our everyday life. And I hope you, my listening friend, will feel empowered to learn a new truth and embrace the life of your dreams. Now today, I'm telling you right now, there's gonna be lots to write about, lots to text about, talk, lots to call about. We are on Facebook Live right now. We're later on, we're gonna be on YouTube. Right now we are live on the radio for those of you who are listening. We have lots of gifts, so I would like for you to be ready, put this number down, because I could get accused of saying it too fast. 407-373-5959. 407-373-5959. Now, for those of you who are wondering why do you need this number, <clears throat> is because I am really, truly excited about the theatrical debut for Eating You Alive. Thank you, Brian. I now can hear. I can hear. Okay, Eating You Alive. For those of you who have not heard of the documentary Eating You Alive, then you have not been listening to the radio show, the Lillimator radio show. Eating You Alive is an educational, inspirational, um, wonderful way to love yourself. Eating You Alive is what people should learn the documentary the information in the documentary eating you alive is what people should learn in kindergarten first grade second grade third grade every day of your life this is information that will help prevent and reverse disease now that we've got everybody settled everything that could have gone wrong this morning went wrong but right now Everything is going right. We are good. We're all good. So <clears throat> now I can tell you what this is about. On April 4th, or April 5th, that's, right. that's 4 or 5, we are going to do a gathering. For those of you who've been longing to have someone to hold your hand so that you can change the way you've been eating improve upon to reverse disease. So many different ways that we can love our bodies. This is one of those ways. 407-373-5959 is gonna give you all sorts of gifts and prizes because you've heard me talking about the Jack's vegan couple, right? You've heard me to brag about them. You hear me tell them when I went to the veg fest, I met the Jack's vegan couple. And ever since we came together, it's as if divine intervention has promoted, prompted something different, something new. And what we're going to do is we're going to, we're going to absolutely become a support group with the Long McDermott Radio Show. We have joining us today to talk about this event on April 5th, we have Ubed and Safura Osmani. And they're also known as the Jack's Vegan Couple. I've been with them for the last couple of days and talk about kindness, hospitality, and anything that is good from this couple, even throwing blankets on the floor <laughs> yesterday as I started my show because of the echo and the, and the sound. These people will do everything and anything to help the world heal. And they start with themselves. 
And since it is our sole purpose in life to give and receive love and knowledge, I am grateful that the Jack's Vegan Couple is here to do just that. Welcome, guys, to the Law McDermott Radio Show. Thank you so much, Lily, for having us on the show today. We are super excited to be here. And that's Safura. And Hi, Lily. Thank you so much for having us over. And and it's so nice to meet you and finally come on the show. Yes, absolutely. And so that was Ubed. Ubed and Safura have made it their passion. And they do this without asking for a penny. But you know what? Just like that. Everything changes because we're going to make this a part of every day's life. 407-373-5959 is going to get a couple of gifts, and I'm going to share those gifts, and I'm going to tell you all about it when we return. Because right now, I just want to ask you, let's start with Sephora. You have a little bit of time left. Share a little bit of how you started your journey. Thank you so much, Lily. So it was very difficult for me to get started on this whole food plant-based journey. But, you know, um, it took time to get there. As I watched Uved go ahead, go ahead. Um, get into this whole food plant-based mode, he started educating the family about wanting to read, eat to live, um, listen, listen to, to Dr. Dr. McGregor, and watch all these episodes that led us to getting more education. And that led you to the Little McDermott Radio Show. And we are live on Facebook. We are live on the radio, AM, FM, we are going to be on YouTube. When we return worldwide at whenyouneedafriend.com, we're gonna talk about all these gifts that you're gonna be getting today from the Lone McDermott Radio Show, and we'll be right here waiting for you. <clears throat> oh, okay. Okay, what you guys don't know <laughs> is that everything that could have gone wrong went wrong. And so I was just trying to calm myself down as we got started, and I saw you that you couldn't so hear. Yeah. No, what Mother Teresa said when she came in, <laughs> everything was like, the station was at a panic. That's right. And she, all she walked in and said, you know, it'll, everything will fall into she place. Did. That oh, is you're it. Amazing. So. <laughs> okay, so Obed and the, Sephora. My, my volume is too high. It was too, too high. high. Yeah. You want to bring it down? Yeah. It's the middle one. Okay, put it on your ears. The middle one. So this is the a background scene. More low. Little more up. Yeah. What about you, Sephora? Let's adjust your earpiece. This is what we do. It's perfect. Perfect. Okay. So what happens is, um, when we get the, the thirty seconds, mm -hmm. or when we get music has started, when you hear yeah. the music, you have thirty seconds still to, to talk. Time. Okay. Okay. Very good. Okay. So for those of you who may have questions, if you Ashley, if you're watching. Text them to me at 407-373-5959 if you guys have any questions today. We're going to talk about how to start a revolution of health. A revolution of health today. That's going to be so many announcements that we have today. So when we come back, you'll get to share each one of your story. We'll have like a minute or so, okay? And then we'll, we have about maybe 10 minutes or so to to um, build and, and that we want to make sure that we talk about the event and what you guys are doing today in Jacksonville, okay? So, <clears throat> so when you say what you're doing today is in the Jack's Vegan Couple. Yes, the Jack's Vegan Couple, channel. yeah. Can you lower the volume just a little bit so that way, um, there you go. So I don't know if you're not gonna be doing the, let me introduce you to Jack's Minerals attorney Hi, everybody. Okay. So I hope you can hear us. Everybody can hear us. We've got the microphone right here. So Ubed, you did a great projection. You really projected very well. Okay. So this, when we come back, I'm going to reintroduce you. Okay. And then we're going to be able to, um, to share a little bit about, and we go back and forth with conversation. If you want to add to anything, just raise your finger, and then I will acknowledge you, because we want people to know your name on the air, okay? We weren't able to prep today, so. <laughs> and welcome back to the Little McDermott Radio Show, where we always learn with one another, and today we have Ubed and Safura. I don't know if you even know this name because most of you know them as the Jack's Vegan Couple. They're in the house today. We are live from Jacksonville and we are sharing information that is going to help us heal. 
So I'm just going to start by asking Sephora. Okay. okay, you said that when we before we went on the break, that the journey really started when Ubed started reading books. He did. Yeah. So Ubed went on a quest for knowledge mm. and education and how to engage and inspire the rest of his family. He did a lot of research and the first book that he read, and I'll let Ubed speak about that. Mm -hmm. So I'll go ahead and, and let, let you know, know that it was a very difficult journey for me to begin with. But as he started educating us and engaging us with information, all the stuff from Dr. McGregor, Dr. Um, Esselstein, Dr. Furman, we started reading the books, following their blogs and looking at information. I got excited. I said, if he can do this, why can't I? So I gave up red meat initially, then I gave up dairy, mm -hmm. and then slowly just started giving up processed food. Cleaned out the kitchen, the fridge, the pantry, and said, I can do this. And I took the online Fork Server Knives nutrition class. Okay. And that led me to really understand that processed food, meat, and no oil was the way to go. And started incorporating the tips that I learned in my cooking. I had a passion for cooking already anyway. So those tips really helped me to become better at it. And I will vouch for that. She is an unbelievable cook and she's been uh, feeding me a lot. And as you know, I love to eat. So it's a great combination. She loves to cook, so do I. So next time I come up, we're gonna do a cook-off. Absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> bring it, yes. bring it. Okay, so, so we just heard from um, Sephora. And Sephora, your background, was it an easy transition for you to, to quit all these things or were you really scared? I was scared. And what were you scared about? Because we talked about fear yesterday. Um, what were you scared about? So it was really hard. Um, I didn't know what whole food, plant-based eating was and how that would affect us and how to educate the rest of the family. Mm -hmm. What would others think? How would I eat if I went out to parties? How would I educate other people? But I knew deep down inside that I saw Ubed going through all these changes on the plant-based diet. He had a lot of energy um, and he felt really good about himself. And I wanted to feel that way too. Okay, so Ubed, why were you, where did you start your, you're the, it's your fault, right? It's your yeah. fault, okay. It huh? was, I, I absolutely agree, Lillian. It was my fault, but it was, it was a good fault. Yes. It was an absolutely good fault that changed everybody. So the reason I started was my parents died at a very young age uh, due to heart disease and stroke. And my uncles and aunts suffered the same fate when I, same heart disease and stroke. So when I asked, started asking my relatives and my friends what had happened to their family, how did they die, everyone suffered the same fate. And then I came across a book called The China Study by mm -hmm. Dr. T. Colin Campbell, and that book changed my whole life. Yes. So when I read that book, I could make a connection between food and diseases. Mm -hmm. And like, you know, most people call, my second book that I read was, most people might call that as a coincidence, but in mathematical terms, coincidence means when two angles perfectly coincide into a triangle. Ah, so yes. that is a coincidence. So the, my second book was the uh, book of world religions. Mm -hmm. And what that book talked about was in about 101 religions that exist in this world. Mm -hmm. And the common denominator that I found in every religion was it says, let food be thy medicine. Wow. What more proof do you want? Yes. And you come from a medical background. <laughs> yes, I come from a medical background. All my brothers, sisters, are everybody, there are 32 doctors in my family. And I'm the only one without an MD. You're the rebel. You're I'm the rebel. rebel. Wait, wait, wait. But, you don't have an MD, but you might but, be a medical detective. Yes. So <laughs> yeah. what, what they, what they <laughs> tell me is, okay, I have an MD, but not a, a medical, medical doctor, doctor, not a miracle doctor, doctor, not a mere doctor, <laughs> but a medical that. detective. Yes, a so, medical detective. Okay. A, so, you know, be your own medical detective. Okay. That's, that's absolutely That's absolutely true. true. Very good. Okay, so as you started your journey and you started reading these books, and you're looking at what you're eating. Did, mm -hmm. did you, were you able to make that link? Were you able to make that connection right away? Or did, was it like Sephora? Did you get scared? 
Uh, I was not scared because when I read the books, uh, the the 20 year study by T. Colin Campbell mm -hmm. that clearly made a connection and that study was done for 20 years yeah. and that was sponsored by uh, the pre uh, Chinese preventative medi uh, medicine. It was sponsored by the Oxford University and E. Cornell University. Yeah. And that was a 20 year st study that was done and there was absolutely no coming back because it proved the link between disease and in what the food you consume. Yes, yes. And, and so that changed, as a matter of fact, when, for those of you who would like to watch a documentary that is life-changing, they're talking about the book, uh, The China Study. So the documentary Forks Over Knives is based on that study and the story, the backstory of Dr. Esselstyn, who's been on the show, and Dr. Uh, T, uh, T. Colin Campbell. So both of them have been on the Limit Dermot Radio Show. You can find them at whenyouneedafriend.com. This is life changing. I have received so many texts, so many emails saying, I wish I would have learned this when I was young. But you what? Guess what? You can learn it now. One of the things that Ubed and I have been talking about um, with this, um, every time we see each other, we, we get to know a little bit more of each other and our, the philosophy and what we've learned. And what we've been taught is that we have our DNA, of course. We're the, the, the model of medicine is based on victim mentality. Because my parents had heart disease or diabetes or uh, cancer, somehow I will get it too. Yes, the DNA is transferred onto us. Yes, we have that but we can turn it on and we can turn it off. What we in truly inherit is the way we eat. So Uved, as you were, as, as you were educating Sephora and educating your brothers and sisters, did you feel at any time that you were ostracized, that you were, that you were made fun of? Yes, absolutely, Lily, absolutely. Whenever I used to go to parties or any social gatherings, I made sure that I ate before I went there. <laughs> and then, you know, because and then then they look at my plate if i just pick up salad or any healthy food they used to pity me thinking oh my god what is that in your plate that you're eating but on the same level i used to look at their plate with all that crud of meat cheese and all the oily foods they, yeah. they have no clue what's doing it to them in their arteries yes and you know because we are fed by, by the, the food, food industry, industry. Mm -hmm. that doesn't pay any concern to health and we are treated by the health industry that doesn't pay any attention to food. So we had literally become a ping pong ball between the medical industry and the food industry. I like that. I like that. That's a really good depiction. So today, for those of you who are listening and anyone, anyone who calls in today, we have a plan for everybody. What we're trying to do between the Little McDermott radio show and the Jack's Vegan Couple, that's Ubed and Sephora, Osmani, for those of you who just don't know they had a name, <laughs> that's their name. Um, we are tr we're going to bring a healthy vegan pod. It's, uh, it's, it's a, a terminology that you will learn when you look at Colin Campbell or Nelson Campbell's um, documentary that he did, Plant Pure, Plant Pure Nation. Yeah, Plant Pure Nation. He's also been on my show. Okay, so what it is, it's basically a support group where we all come together and we support one another. For those of you who would like to be a part of this, everybody who wants to be a part of it, if they text 407-373-5959, and text me your email address. Not only will you be added to the Lily McDermott Radio Show, um, the, the, the mail out, okay? And you will need to approve also that we've added you to the list. You will also, for Jack's Vegan Couple, you will be added to their mailing list. And then when you, then there's gonna be the event on April 5th, which is the movie, Eating You Alive. It's the largest nationwide release of a movie this kind. It's a documentary that will teach you how, what you're doing to yourself, what you're doing to yourself. When you eat fried foods, when you eat processed foods, fast foods, anything that's, that's a Franken food. There's a lot of fake foods out there. So that's April 5th at 7 p.m. is the movie. And we're going to be at Tinseltown, right? That's right. Okay, so for, we're going to be at Tinseltown because yes. I, I, I'm not very familiar with all the theaters, but there's three other, there's two other locations that you can go to. Okay, so at five o'clock, 
we're getting together and we're sharing a meal. So for a share about that meal that we're going to have. Absolutely. Thank you, Lily. And we would love for all of you to join us. Like Lily said, you can go to our Facebook page that has all the event information. We will be meeting for dinner at Pho Today, a Vietnamese vegan restaurant. We talk to the owners and they're more than happy to share a vegan, non-MSG, all the food items with us. So please, when you register and when you sign up, let us know and we'd love for you to join us. Yes. So this, this event that's going to be at five o'clock, we're going to start together. We're going to introduce one another. Then we're going to share a meal. I'm looking forward to eating at Pho today. Uh, they don't even know that we're talking about them today. They don't. No, they don't. But we do need for you to send, let us know when you text me at 407-373-5959 if you want to be a part of the dinner. Now, if you want to go to the movie and the theatrical release, on that's at 7 o'clock. And, and wherever you're listening from, nationwide, they look it up. Go to eatingyoualive.com, and you just enter your location, and it will tell you. Now, we're in Jacksonville going to do this event at 5 p.m. at this restaurant. I'm trying to get someone to do an event in the Merritt Island, which is in Melbourne, where I live, right there i'm hoping that someone will volunteer to do a a wonderful maybe a meet and greet while i'm here over there and then maybe i'll switch over there and do another one while i'm there but what i'd like to do is for us to become this, this ridicule this ridicule that we hear all the time of you know what do you eat how do you do this what's going on uh i mean uh, so um ubed has mentioned that he felt it have you did you feel it too safura Absolutely. So um, a lot of ridicule, actually. But giving kudos to Ubed again, no matter, he traveled for work a lot, and he would always find a hotel next to Whole Foods. Yes. So he could be close to a salad. When his coworkers went and ate out, he would um, have his healthy meal. Such as myself, when I went out with friends, they would look at my plate and really pity me. Oh my God, Sephora, what is that? You're just having salad. Come on, you can have a piece of chicken or fish. That's much healthier than red meat. But I knew it wasn't because of all the research that we had done. And we knew that whole food plant-based was the way to go. Yes. So really quickly, tell, tell okay, what, what we're going to do is we're going to say, for now, 407-373-5959. Text me your email address. If you're not subscribed on the Lil McDermott Radio Show, uh, when you need a friend.com, then we'll subscribe you. And then also, you'll also be subscribed with Jack's Vegan Couple, and we will send you an invitation. We want to know if you want to be a part of the dinner before the movie. So get 407 373 5959. Start your talk calling, start your dialing, and let's heal together. 407-373-5959, and we'll be right here waiting for you worldwide at whenyouneedafriend.com. <laughs> okay. You are so good. No, right now I'm feeling a little, we want to get, a, we want to talk about what you've created since. Okay. And that's, we'll be on the third, but right now, since we are being picked up here, we're being, um, why don't you share a little bit about your background story and where you're at today? Um, Ubed, what, what transformations have happened to you in your life since, and how long has it been since you started your journey? 10 years. 10, 10 years. years, okay. Well, yeah. no, right here. So now we're here. So speak loud enough so that we yeah. can hear you over yeah. there. I wanted to uh, briefly present what are the common diseases. These are the stats of okay. the yeah. mortality. Of okay. The Let's do that when we come back. Okay, and I apologize for not. Um, so if you if you have a question, just raise your finger. If you want to add anything, just raise your finger, and then I will acknowledge you. And you can you know, and if you want to ask a question to me or whatever, just say my name, and then we're doing okay. And by the way, Brian, I can hear Ed Dean on the earpiece. I don't know why it's bleeding through. Yeah, there's a submarine that's done. I don't know. That's a wire to the board because if I focus on me, it's gonna be him. Oh, really? I wonder, has he worked on it? Um, I don't know. We haven't, we haven't been live in the studio. So oh, okay, okay. So, go ahead. Uh, no, you go ahead. If you want to talk or I can. She's saying don't go into all those details, but they need to know. 
it's up to you briefly you can, yeah. because maybe that can be a subsequent show we can do that and that you know what this is what this is about why don't you share some of this information Uved, about the statistics and then get closer to this yeah. mic the statistics is really like we spend about 318 billion dollars on heart diseases in the united states and the pharmaceutical industry turns back and sells us about $350 billion worth of statins. Mm -hmm. And you know, the sad fact is the top leading causes in the United States is number one is coronary heart disease at 614,000. Mm -hmm. That's more than half a million. And the cancer deaths and the lung disease is about 592,000. The iotrinic diseases, meaning, uh, mess up from medications, hospital staff errors, people who get the wrong interaction from medications and so and so forth is about 225,000. Brain is that diseases, a year? Is that that's a year? about a year, yeah. yeah. And then the brain diseases or Alzheimer's is 226,000. So just to put you in perspective, all the car accidents, the plane accidents and natural accidents occurred in United States. The death for in 2016 was 130,000. But at the same time, the 2017 statistics shows we lost 2.3 million deaths in USA because of chronic conditions. That is, uh, these are statistics that have been verified. And for, for those of us that are still in resistance, and we can't give up certain things. What we're giving up really is disease. That's right. And we're embracing good health. So I'm hoping that today that you will feel empowered to, to join us um, wherever it is that you're at. I want to encourage you to start um, an event, to do an event. I, I hear. Is that me? Okay. I'm hearing, I'm hearing this. I'm, I'm like, I'm trying to. I'm, go ahead. Also, Lily, like you always say on your show. Take a pill or take responsibility. <laughs> I love that tagline. And you know, I chose to take responsibility and everybody, everybody, it's so simple on this, who's listening to this show, go to Lily's tagline, either take a pill or take responsibility because when you take responsibility, your health changes for the better. That's right. Everything changes. Changes, yeah, absolutely. You know, yesterday I said, when you change the way you look at things, the things you look at change. When I heard Wayne Dyer say that, 25 30 years ago it changed my life right there it's it's a you make a decision you make a choice that you're going to make a change you're going to make a difference okay so i am looking i'm, I'm going to check and see what's going on here john hey ashley hey text me if you have any questions 407-373-5959 i can't see all this here we go Okay, got it wrong. This is where I'm going to go over a little bit of the, uh, I'll wait till next time. Welcome back to the Long Dark Radio Show where we learn and grow together. Today in the house is Ubed and Safura Osmani. For those of you who didn't even know that they had a name, that's their name. They're known as Jack's Vegan Couple. You will find them everywhere encouraging, inspiring, and motivating people to make a change in their life. And it could be a small change. By the way, so I guess I've been a little vague here. For those of you who want to change their life, you want to make a difference, you want to reverse disease, anything that you want to do, please call 407-373-5959. Include your email address. Join us. Join this movement. You know, when we talk about on the Little McDermott radio show, we always talk about responsibility. As we were talking off the air, Ubed was saying that he loves, you can take a pill, you can take responsibility. Some people are offended by that, by the way, because they feel that it's not their fault that they have disease because they look at that victim uh, mentality when it comes to health. But the reality is what we inherit is our family recipes, the way we think, the way we feel, the way we act. And yesterday I talked about on the show how important it is to rewrite the program that was in, engraved, is engraved in our subconscious mind. These are videos that as little bitty babies, we record everything, everything we hear, everything we see, 
becomes part of a recording, and that recording becomes part of our subconscious mind. So because of that, and these tapes have been paying 70,000 thoughts a day, and 80% of them, 90% of them are reoccurring, 80% of them are negative thoughts. These are the thoughts in our mind. I don't want to get sick. That's one of our basic fears. So how do we, what's the antidote? The antidote is to be healthy, to eat healthy, to think healthy, because first it's the thought, then it's the feeling, then it's the action. So today, I want all of us to make the declaration, I am healthy. Does it resonate with you? Does it resonate with you? If it doesn't resonate with you, then what will? I want to be healthy. I'm going to be healthy when? Today. Today's the day. The first case, the first action that I would like for you to take is make a date with us. Sephora, Ubed, and I will be at where? We will be at Tinseltown on April 5th, 7 p.m. And then we'll be at the dinner who wants to join us at Faux Today at 5 p.m. Okay, this documentary is the documentary Eating You Alive. I have the original copy, and that is going, this was given away at the, on the show. This is like a hot, you know, because this has taken a long time to come into the theater. This is a nationwide release. If you want to make a change, if you want to make a difference, reverse disease, prevent disease, <clears throat> prevent your children's future disease, this is where you want to go. So on March 28th, I believe that's the Wednesday, March, oh no, I'm sorry, April 28th, there we go. April 28th, that's gonna be our first meeting, our first gathering. And this is where we're gonna to come together and support one another. Jacksonville, Brevard County, worldwide, I'm calling to action. A call to action is all of you, all of you, wherever you live, Create something like this. Let's talk about the, the pod or the healthy vegan pod that we want. And you don't have to be vegan. You just have to be open for change. Go Absolutely. Ahead, Thank you, Lily. As you know, we were recently on a, a vegan cruise, a mm -hmm. holistic holiday cruise, and we met with Nelson Campbell, Dr. T. Colin Campbell, and we were talking about our role, Jack's Vegan Couple in Jacksonville and what we were doing with the community. And I explained that we had thousands of members and we always got together for Veg Fest and we had these meetings. And they invited us to sit in on a meeting that day and said, why don't you create a plant pure nation pod, healthy pod within your community and help spread the word. Mm -hmm. So um, we signed up, we took on the responsibility, we spoke with Lily, and in partnership, we are going to be having meetings on a monthly basis. Our kickoff will be April 28th. More information on our website as yeah. well. It'll be here at the Salem Center. Yes. The first meeting is going to be here, and as we come together, we'll decide where the meetings are going to continue. I want all of you to be there. I want, remember when we gave away the essential oils, and I said, everybody who calls today will get the digital access to Dr. Z's essential oils, um, healthy living, or whatever the, the, it was called. I had so many of you text me, call me. Today should be no different. How many of you that are listening today want to be healthy? How many of you? want to stop taking medication. Ubed, give your statistics real quick about um, health and wellness and this world and this where this is the state of where we're at. I want you to listen to these verified statistics. Really, thank you. Um, one of the worst statistics, I'll just talk about the most 10 common diseases in the United States. For example, number one top is coronary heart disease with 614,000. Mm -hmm. And then next leading is cancer deaths of 592,000. And iatronic diseases like from malpractice, from medicine or mm -hmm. drug interaction, so and so forth, about 225,000. Digestive cancers, 110,000. Just to keep in perspective, the car accidents and deaths included in statistics of 2016 was 130,000 only. But by just these common diseases, the total, uh, total number came to 2.3 million 
deaths in, in the, the United States. States. So 2.3 million deaths, something that is preventable and reversible. Like Dr. Esselstyn says, this needs not happen. If you are driving right now, if you're listening today, if you're watching on YouTube, if you're watching on Facebook Live, which thank you so much for doing all of these things, or if you're listening on the radio, just know that wherever you're at, whatever pills you're taking, that you can reverse it with food. Let thy food be your medicine. Go ahead. And also, uh, when I uh, turned to whole food plant-based diet, all my symptoms went away, my high blood let's pressure, talk, Let's cholesterol. talk about where you were before. Before I was like, you know, too much, I had higher cholesterol, mm -hmm. I had high blood pressure, I had stomach issues, and my doctor goes, because your parents died with heart disease and stroke, you inherit that in your genes. Mm. But I proved to him by numbers, when I reversed to this whole food plant-based diet, all the symptoms went away. And I gave the doctor an example. Of course, I inherit my genes from my parents, but I also gave him an example if I put, if I take grass seeds, for example, grass seeds are nothing but 100% genetic grass seeds. If I put that on the table, it's not going to grow unless I provide the environment of water, sunlight, and soil. Mm -hmm. So that is what food does to us. By we providing those means, we, pretend, we can change the genes. Well, all you flowers listening to the Little McDermott radio show, all you flowers that want to blossom, hear this. Call 407-373-5959. Text me your email address. When you call or call and leave me your email address, you can call, leave a message. Okay, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna add you to our database. We will send you invitations. We have to, you ha we have to put you on our database. You know what? Just call 407-373-5959. Just send it to us and see what happens. Have that intention to be healthy. Have that intention to change, be a, a generational pattern shifter. A generational pattern shifter says, that is it. No more. Not in my family. No more for our children. And learn a new truth about how food is medicine. 407-373-5959. We will add you not only to the Little McDermott Radio Show, when you need a friend.com database, we'll also add you to jacksvegancouple.com. That's where you can find Ubed and Sephora. They are changing lives. The show hopefully is changing lives and giving you a new truth. Now, that doesn't mean you have to be vegan. It doesn't mean you have to eat the way we say. But here's the thing. Consider it. Just consider it. Ubed? And really the most important decision three times a day anyone can that make is what to put in their mouths yes and what to eat that changes their life well it, according to my calculations i probably make that choice 20 times today because <laughs> i am always eating i love food what can i say i love food <laughs> okay so for those of you call 407-373-5959 what are we also going to give them sephora we are going to give them a, an ebook that has loads of information, tips, resources, recipes, over 70 recipes, a 21 day meal plan that Ubed and I have put together. Like Lily said, whether you're just starting out or you're already on this path, how to get started, where should I shop for groceries, meal planning, um, what should I eat for breakfast, lunch, or dinner, and lots of links and resources. And that's what we're gonna do together as a support group. I also want you to know that you can do this. You don't want to give up your meat, then you're basically saying, I want colon cancer or I want some form of disease too. But I'm not saying that you have to give it up completely. Just consider reducing it. Wherever you're at, we will meet you where you're at. If you're eating 65 ounces of animal products a day, Let's talk about 30. <laughs> Let's talk about reducing. And we're going to continue. Call 407-373-5959. Text me or call me and give me your email address. And we'll be right here waiting for you worldwide at whenyouneedafriend.com. Okay. So what else? So who else is out there? I see, I see nobody's texting me. I mean, there are people texting me, but not okay. Ashley. Let's see. John, Robert. Hey, Robert. How are you? Okay, so for those of you, this will go for you. If you want to be a part of this, 
what we're doing is we're creating a community. You can also go to the Lillian McDermott Radio Show group. And do you have a group on Facebook for Jack's Vegan Couple? You know, we can create one. Okay. Yes. So maybe we can create, maybe we can use the Lillian McDermott Radio Show as that as well. What's happening is that the posts and the information that we're posting on Lillian's radio show, because it's a fan page, you're only getting 10% of it. So what we'd like to do is for you to join the Lillian McDermott Radio Show group. When you do that, you get all the information, all the giveaways, everything that we're doing. So I want to encourage you to do to call or text me, 407-373-5959. And I want all of those things that you're doing. Okay. Absolutely, okay. Lily. So anything that you would like, um, Sephora, um, let's talk about the food you prepare. Do you keep your food uh, traditional Indian or do you do other, um, um, other different foods? Lily, I try to do a blend of everything. Of course you do. Anything that is healthy, whole food, plant-based. We visit the farmer's market every single weekend. We help support um, our local farmers as well as any produce that's in season. And you'll see me in the kitchen. So I was preparing okra, but I added some fresh yes. uh, toasted coconuts. Lily liked that. Um, so like I said, I give you lots of different recipes and inspiration. It could be Indian, but also a lot of um, um, soup, salad, dressings, um, pasta, everything in a much healthier way. In 30 minutes, I'll show you how to meal prep for the week, um, how to make grains, vegetables, soup, and salad. Every Sunday is our meal prep day at home. Every Sunday? So every if you, Sunday. If you come over to our house, will you prep at our house too? Absolutely. <laughs> so that's what we're going to teach. This is what we're going to do together. We're going to become a community. And even if, and we could probably even do Facebook Live so people who want to join us that don't live close to us would be able to participate Absolutely. online. So we're, we're creating <laughs> Sky's the Limit. Yes. Go ahead. We are on all social channels. Lily said Facebook Live. But there is a lot going on with Instagram, Instagram Live, and Instagram Stories as well. And uh, we'll be doing that as well as YouTube Live videos, meal prepping ideas um, on every single social channel you can imagine, Lily. And she's the queen <laughs> of, I call her the 50-year-old millennial. <laughs> Actually, 30, we'll 2895 millennial. Did I say that out loud? <laughs> Um, but what is it like to have started this uh, Jack's Vegan Couple? It's usually what happened, Lily, is people were asking what to do, what to eat, based on the research that I had done. And uh, we were sending emails and, you know, text messages and phone calls. So we thought, I and Sapura thought, why not, you know, put up a website Let's and, you know, it. have this information available to everybody. Isn't that how it all starts, right? Yeah, that's how it all started. And, and welcome, welcome back to the Little McDermott Radio Show. We are Facebook Live. We're going to be on YouTube in a little bit. We're, we're on the radio, AM, FM. We're at whenyouneedafriend.com. We're, we're everywhere, social media. I, I want to encourage you to subscribe, subscribe not only to Jack's Vegan Couple, couple but, but also to the Little McDermott, McDermott Radio Show. show. So, so by calling, calling today, 407-373-5959, one clean swoop. Just, just send, send us your email address. address. We will register you into the website. website. How, How easy is that? <laughs> but here's what you need to do. You will get a confirmation email. Confirm it. And once you confirm it, you are in. Now, now what's going to happen is, I've, I've been listening been to uh, what's, what's, what's happened. happened. Not, not what's, what's going, going to happen. happen. What, what has happened, happened is, is that, that we are going to create a support group. group. As, As I, I mentioned yesterday, fear. Fear, fear of rejection. There are so many different fears that we have. Fear of ill health, ill health. Fear of rejection, fear of being criticized. There are so many different fears. Is your fear greater than your passion to be healthy? You've got to take out your soul shovel and dig. Because I don't care if you're skinny. If you're not eating well, you're still the void of nutrients. It's not about being skinny. That's why it's a healthy vegan group. It's not about potato chips and, and Coke. It's not about taking the healthy whole food plant-based 
it's, it's really, really a whole food plant based, but most, most people don't. don't. What's a whole food plant based, right? <laughs> we were talking about that last time. Right? Yeah. So, 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 go ahead. Go ahead. So, so, so. Whole food plant based lifestyle change of eating fruits, starchy vegetables, complex carbohydrates, intact whole grain without any added process, oils or salts, mm -hmm. and food that, is, that doesn't have a mother or a face. <laughs> and, and if you really, uh, if you look at, there are thousands and thousands and thousands of testimonials from patients who got better by just following, like for example, you know, in no particular order, Dr. Neil Bernard, Dr. Joel Furman, Dr. Dean Ornish, Dr. Cadwell Esselstyn, Michael Greger, Joel Khan, John McDougall, Colin Campbell, Garth Davis, Michael Clapper, Alan Goldhammer, Doug Lyle, Jeff Novick, the list goes on and on. And they don't have the medical power or the dollar amount to advertise. But you go to their websites and look at all the patients, thousands of testimonials that they reverse disease. And with the exception of Dr. Clapper is going to be coming on the long-term radio show soon. With the exception of one of the people that you said, every single one of them has been on the long-term radio show. And the goal of the long-term radio show is to teach a new, a new truth. truth. There was, there was a time, time that they thought the earth was flat, flat but, but there are still people who think the earth is flat. When is it? When is your time? When will you learn that, the, that there's a difference, there's a new truth? And here's what we're doing. We are putting together a support group. I get so many texts of people saying, I'm afraid. How do I start? What do I eat? Where do I shop? Where do I do all this stuff? And that's where Sephora, Ubed, and the experience of the teachers that I've had on the show, we are going to hold your hand through this. Now, in Brevard County, I'm not leaving you alone. We're going to create something there, but I need your help. I can't do this everywhere. So I need people to come forward and help me in Brevard County. I've got the people here in Jacksonville that have come up and said, we're, we're doing, doing it. We are so excited. excited. I mean, they're excited to do this. So uh, uh, go, go ahead, ahead Sephora. We, we are so excited. As, as a matter of fact, fact we, we heard Lily speak at the Veg Fest. Fest. <laughs> <laughs> and that was definitely a friend that we had made forever. Mm -hmm. Listening to Lily speak that day about all the things that Abed and I are passionate about, whole foods, healthy eating, compassionate, caring, and giving of ourselves to others. And sharing that knowledge and information. Thank you. That was a very light. That was the light of my. Well, there were so many lights of my day that day. You guys, I was like five o'clock. Nobody was in there. I'm looking down, like I'm setting up. No matter if any, if just one person shows up, I will do my talk. And so I was sitting there, and all of a sudden, this bright, beautiful couple walks in and goes. Is Lillian McDermott giving a talk? And I look up and I said, I'm Lillian McDermott. And then they, oh my God, I listen to your show every day. That. Just was music to my ears. And you know, for those of you who are listening today and you think that you can't do this, then you won't. But if you believe you can, you will. And when you have someone holding your hand through the process and telling you that you are enough to figure this out, you've got the nutritional aspect with the Jack Vegan couple. Then as a life coach, you've got the mind, body, spirit uh, combination between the three of us. And for those of you who want to join us, the to those of you who are teachers out there, whether you're in Jacksonville, Daytona, if you're listening worldwide, I am challenging you right now to start a group, a group that will help each other, lift each other up, right? Where our start, our kickoff, where we're going to come together and meet one another is on April 5th, Eating You Alive. Where are we meeting again, Sephora? We are meeting at Faux Today for dinner in Jacksonville and then for the movie at Cinemark Tinseltown in Jacksonville as well on that site. That's, That's right. right. And for those of you who want to go to eat with us and meet us, please text us at 407 Not just leave us your email address, but also let us know that you're in for the date. Okay, okay, go ahead. For us. Also, Lily, they can go to your page, your page or um, Jack's Vegan Couple, couple or Lillian McDermott's Facebook page. It's Facebook page. What the best happened for you? you. Event there you can for you. register. You can register you can and you can let what us else? She's my social what media. Else? She taught me yesterday, yesterday, the day before yesterday, the day before how, yesterday how to do stories. So I'm now on stories and Instagram because of this woman. So Lily and I were having a lot of fun over the weekend. We did a lot of Instagram stories. But, but to come, come back, back um, just, just wanted, wanted to let, let you know it's all about technology, social media. Like Uved mentioned, we 
where being approached by so many friends, family, and neighbors, when we moved to Jacksonville three years ago, uh, what a joy that was, living so close to the ocean and the sunshine. But not only that, the people that we have met, um, we started doing monthly potlucks and neighborhood gatherings, teaching people how to eat a healthy, whole food, plant-based lifestyle, doing, doing cooking demos and potlucks in the house. But from that, uh, we became friends and we met so many people. On our social channel, you will find lots of recipes, how to get started, how to do preps, how to um, talk to, you know, get more information on how to become healthy. And for those of you who call right now, 407-373-5959, the 21-day meal plan, plan, is that a is challenge? That a challenge? Absolutely. Absolutely. It, it is, is a challenge that you can get started and take with us. And it has from morning to evening, what to eat, what not to eat, how to get started, where to buy your groceries, and how to meal prep. And if you need a coach, if you want to do this with a group, then we're going to get together on April 28th here at the Salem Center where the radio show is broadcast out. And we're going to come together and we're going to hold each other's hand. Are you interested in that? Do you want to make a change? Do you feel that you can do this? Well, Together, we are an overwhelming majority. Together, we can reach critical mass. Ubed, I'd like for you to share the final word here. Yes. What's, what's brewing? I can feel it. I can feel it. This, this, is, not, this is an easy journey. Even if you plan on a thousand mile journey, it always starts with the first step. That's a beautiful thing. There's nothing to be afraid about because you are. Don't be, Don't be afraid, afraid of taking the journey. journey. We, are we are here to hold your hands. If you have any questions, feel free to write on our website. Do us a call. It's all absolutely free. Yes, and we're going to come together. Now, this is on the first thing, the first step. That, that journey of a thousand miles is going to begin with one step. I want to encourage all of you, everybody who's listening, either here or in YouTube, Facebook, wherever, Go to Eating You Alive, check out locally where it's playing your theater, get, get advanced tickets, because if you don't get advanced tickets, you may, that, that, that event may be canceled. So, so get, get your, your friends, friends, get your group, get your, get your tribe together, and make a decision to heal. Go ahead, Ben. And most people plan on vacations, most people plan for their retirement, nobody, nobody plans for their health. You might make all the money you want, you might have all the Material, material belonging that you want, but at the end of your life, life, if you don't, you don't, have, don't have health, everything is not lost. Absolutely. Absolutely. That's, That's the, the one. one. This, this, the, the, the saying goes that a healthy man has a thousand dreams, yeah. but an unhealthy person or man has, has one, one yeah. Yeah. which is health. Thank, Thank you so much, you bed. Thank you. Thank, Thank you, you much, Sephora. Thank the Jacks Vegan yeah. Beach pro Couple. Yeah. Yeah. Couple. Yeah. The Jacks Vegan yeah. Couple, yeah. yeah. Uh, and for those and of you, call 407-373-5959. Make that decision, Make that decision now, now to start, to start your, life your life again. again. Start it, start it over. Make the make rest, the rest of, your life of your life healthier. This healthier. first part of your first life. 473 5959. And we're going to continue this conversation. This conversation. Always. Always. Please, Please remember, remember, I'll be, I'll be right, right here waiting for you. Worldwide at whenyouneedafriend.com. This is Long Term wishing you love, peace, joy, unexpected abundance. Make it the best day ever. That's the best ever, ever. Yeah. That is the best ever, ever. So, what are you going to do about this? What are you going to do about this? Are you going to. Create a tribe, join us, because we can do this on Facebook Live, we can do it when we first get together. We want everybody to feel empowered. We want everyone to feel that they matter. Can you, can you turn the volume off altogether? There you go, perfect. So any last words of wisdom before we say goodbye to our extended show? Doing good is good for your health. And always remember, we are here for you. Like Lily said, you know, we're here as a support Thanks, system. Yes. We want to help you get a better life and a better health. Just invest in your health. Take care of your health. Just follow all the plant-based doctors. They have done miracles because, you know, they don't have the marketing dollar to advertise, but look at their testimonials. When somebody is cured of a lifestyle causing disease, they wanted to tell the whole world. I am totally free of medications, totally free of any symptom whatsoever now. Yes, and you can, this is something that you can change. You can make a difference in your life. I'm so excited. Thank you again. Thank, Those you, of you, thank you, I'm getting a little bit high up here. I'm going to say goodbye to everybody.
Thank you for joining us on Facebook Live. I don't know if I can, uh, nope, I won't be able to I'll do, do that. Right. I'll can do you do it? it? Yes. Oh, she's my millennial. Yes. For those of you, thank you so much for watching.